Hello and welcome to the second episode of the Endgame Iron Man series. Thank you for stopping by today. Like I had mentioned in the first episode, which if you haven't watched, I strongly recommend you go watch right now. Um, the main focus of this video is the grind to 1000 Chambers KC, which we do eventually hit. And we do get a little bit sidetracked on the way with the wilderness rework. Uh, we hit up some of the bosses, we hit up some wilderness slayer to try and get some revenants tasks. And the streak just continues. Uh, I don't really know what to say, but I'm having a great time on the video game. Uh, so like I will probably always say, if you have any thoughts or feedback on things that I can do differently or better, please just leave me a comment and I'll see what I can do. So again, thanks for tuning in and I hope you enjoy. I know I got the staff, or the shadow I guess, um, but I could have used it as Amy, but I really didn't feel like it. Uh, it's been kind of crazy at work today, so I've been just trying to AFK as much stuff as I can. So there's that task done. Uh, the Rev and Wilderness update just came out the other day. So maybe what we'll try and do is start a little bit of Wilderness Slayer. I was going to wait on this, but I figured why not? So let's see what we get. I'm also just going to check in on this stuff, see. I unlock this. I still need heart and gem, so I might as well do the barrage task. So I also need slayer points, so and as many keys to get uh, Dagon High. So I'm not gonna skip or tutorial skip to do to get rev tasks. Maybe eventually, but right now I kind of want to just restock on some points. So let's see the first thing that we get. Yeah. Okay. That's fine. Well, first, uh, will the jellers? Oh my gosh. Um, will the jelly task completed? And I got eight Larens keys. That's pretty ridiculous. First raid after the crystal recolor. Uh, I went with the black. I think it definitely looks the cleanest. Um, I am just waiting for the Pagasian recolor because the green with the Verzik Slayer helm just doesn't look great. Um, I think this is 890 KC. So while I'm talking, let's, uh, I guess we'll do some milk. I don't know. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. It was like 30 something. Yeah. Average luck here. Uh, so I don't know if this happened to anybody else, but my raid data tracker plugin just completely reset. So I just don't really know how many points I'm at since my last purple. I just know off of KC. I mean, I guess I could go back and look at all the screenshots, but I can't be asked to do that. Um, so let's see if we get something we do not. Um, so it's like the blood runes, 998 for both. That's kind of spooky. Um, but yeah, that's 41 KC since the last drop. Um, if I can be bothered, I'll look at all the points. Uh, I don't, I generally don't die. And if I do, I usually just leave the raid because I'm annoyed. Um, so we can maybe guesstimate around 30 to 33,000 points of raid, depending. Um, but that's 41 raids. We keep going. And this raid is kill count 900. It is another white light, but that is quite all right. Um, like I said, we're gonna stay here till 1000 KC. Can take a look at the log real quick. We are nine out of 12 and we keep grinding. This is like 49 drive for a dupe. What do we get? 
No shot. That's my third top. Where are the pants, man? That's sad. For the back to back, this head phase has been pretty toxic. So, surely, I actually just get back to back with ancestral pants right here. Nope. Just a few kills later for another duplicate. Let's see what we get. Another Dex. Lovely. It's like Dex number 11 or something. It is. 19th scroll. We are just going to stay around 70% scroll rate, aren't we, huh? Alright, last night of the night. Will we get lucky? We'll milk it. Holy shit! Oh my god! 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 This is either a bow or a Kodai. Oh my fucking god! I gotta tell oh. oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> So we ended up doing the back-to-back -back on stream last night and didn't get anything. Uh, and then I had the chance to sleep it off. Um, I'm glad to see that the Twisted Bow was actually real and was still in my bank when I woke up. Um, I'm just in such disbelief. I don't even know what is going on. The last two months have been absolutely insane for this account. Uh, finishing full Torva, getting the Shadow, the Tebow, you know, Amulet of Eternal Glory, and a bunch of other random things. It's just been the craziest time. Um, and it's awesome. <laughs> so, so happy and like very motivated, which I haven't felt this way in a while, I guess. Um, so I guess we'll still try and send to a thousand KC. Um, Cause getting the ancestral pants would be pretty huge for Shadow. Um, Cause they do want to go back to Fasani's and I will now have to go back to TOA to finish my story. Uh, Cause I can't be out here rocking the, the Armadil top and I don't have the Masori mask. So I have the stupid bird helmet. Um, so we'll keep working on this. I a lot of people are telling me to go to Theater of Blood to try and get the scythe to get just like three massive weapons in this episode, so we might do that. I did do uh, five hard mode tobs, I don't know, maybe a week and a half ago I was invited. Um, I died almost every single one at least once because I've barely done any tob lately, let alone hard mode tob, um, but that was pretty fun. Um, I do enjoy TOB, so I definitely want to get back to it soon, and having scythe would be huge. Um, when going for Grandmasters, which now is very much a possibility um, that helps so much with Zuck. It helps... Well, that's really mainly it. Um, and I guess I do have the uh, CM solo time. Uh, but yeah. Um, still in absolute disbelief that I do now have a Twisted Bow. I honestly never thought I would have one. Um, the plan for the second episode was to do a lot of like collection log and clue things. But I don't know if I'm gonna wanna do that after this. Um, so we'll see how that goes. But um, we're gonna head back into chambers, I guess. I kind of got bored of just sending raid after raid so i decided to buy some scouts and go for some speeds and here we pb'd by about 30 seconds for a 1625 could have definitely been faster um, and i can definitely get some better scouts but i'll take a pb
While I was at it with the speeds, I figured I would try and send the CM Grandmaster solo time. Uh, this was my first completion after going back to CMs with a 3922, which was a PB about by about five minutes. Obviously, I think I got carried pretty hard by the bow and the shadow. Um, but I am definitely better than I was when I was trying this the last. Um, and then after a day and a half of banging my head uh, with tecton resets and dying to ohm and me to dial and vasa and all that sort of stuff, we did eventually get the time. I didn't record anything from that run, but I'll post a screenshot here. Uh, and that means the only chambers of Zarek common achievement I have left is the trio speed time. Well, we got a purple. It's a duplicate. We're like 40 something dry, including all the CM. So what do we get? An arcane. Oh, wow. Lovely. Arcane, that might be number 10. Number nine. Nice. I was having a difficult time finding a decent chamber scout and I was asked to kill some Callisto. And I'm glad I did. Just what I need. Oh my god! <laughs> I'm out. Oh my god. I'm running. Holy shit. What? Holy crap. What? Yeah. I was like, what is this loop beam? This will be the 100th little D task here. Um, I've still only had two rev tasks and they're both under 50. So I feel like we've been pretty unlucky because I've also skipped quite a few. So let's see what we get. That's a skip. 100 scorpions. I'm not doing Scorpia, so I'm just gonna go cannon them in the Scorpia cave because I can't be asked to kill 100 Scorpia. It's gonna take forever. So, uh, yeah. We'll probably gonna call it with Wildy Slayer here. Um, although I do want to go finish the Void Waker, but I can just do that off task, I think. Um, so. Yeah, we're gonna get this 100th task, and then I guess we're just gonna go Turial skip for Zuck. And there it is, 100 Wildy tasks completed, with two Rev tasks to my name. So let's, I guess, go hit up Steve and see if we can just get a Zuck task right off the rip. But uh, yeah, I guess. Finishing the Void Waker would be sweet, but really in no rush for it, and not getting Rev's task, because, you know, that's just bad RNG right there. Well, let's see, it's a long run. Let's grab a ring from the bank. A nice chunk of points. We started doing Wildy Slayer with uh, zero, I think. So I'll take 1800. We're just going to Turial skip, probably. So yeah, that's a <laughs> instant skip. Okay, well, that took one Turial skip. <laughs> uh, I got Scorpions, and here we are. And now we have a Zuck task. The Zuxias that I have left to do are quite a few of them. We need just to get one more KC for this one. Uh, the killing the triple jads really quickly. The 50 HP one, which uh, I'm not going to attempt anytime soon, probably. 
Uh, so just get it by RNG. Um, no magic spells, melee, inferno, jad skip, and the speeds. So I'll have to think about it, kind of see how I'm feeling, and see what we want to try. Had to redo the audio on this clip because my girlfriend got home just as I killed the boss. And of course, we got a purple light, which does mean that it is a duplicate. And we stay here for a little bit as she's talking. We eventually make our way to the chest and open it. And we get another dex. Which is much better than getting another arcane. Because these are actually worth a little bit of something nowadays. Uh, we'll probably just throw this into death's coffer or maybe drop it over to the main. Who knows? No. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yes. Oh my god, this is... Oh my god! Yes! Oh my god! <laughs> Let's see! You got them! <laughs> It is recording, by the way. Oh. <laughs> That's ridiculous. I was going to do the last CA that I needed for a thousand kill count, but I figured I would do the back-to-back -back, um, solo, um, but there it is, 1,000 Chambers of Zarek, 11-12, uh, 11 out of 12 missing Kodai, only duplicates that I've gotten is the Ancestral Top and Scrolls, which is kind of crazy. Um, but yeah, we just have one last Chambers of Zarek common achievement to do, and that's the Grandmaster Trio speed. Um, so I'll keep an eye out on the scouting discord and see what I can get. Uh, but this does mean that we now need to get a third kit. Um, so we'll be working on that on the side, I guess. We've been pretty lucky on these two, so hopefully that RNG keeps up. But um, as you can tell from that pants clip, uh, kind of actually, I I'm just still in disbelief in the last two months. Um, I was expecting like maybe one new unique in the 140-ish chambers that I did, but we got two. Um, and two of the those two being the ones that I wanted the most. The code I would be sweet, but I do have an Eldritch to hold me over for the time being. Um, but yeah, that's, I just, I don't think I'll ever be able to top this episode. <laughs> so, uh, I guess I gotta get to, to editing and if I am able to find a decent scout for the speed, I'll do that. Because unfortunately I'll have to ruin the clean 1000, but it is what it is. If you've made it this far into the video, thank you so much for watching. I truly hope you enjoyed. If you are dry on these items or you're still trying to get them, I apologize. I don't really know what's going on, but it does seem like 2023 is my year. Uh, it's just absolutely insane. That's really all I can say. RNG do be a thing. Um, I'm definitely really enjoying the game at the moment. It's crazy how much more fun you have when you streak and are consistently getting big ticket items it's just it's wild uh, but like i mentioned episode one and two were originally going to be one video but i did end up splitting them so we are a little bit behind in regards to what is currently happening in real time episode three is already in progress and the streak 
it keeps going. I don't know. But anyways, if you enjoyed, please drop a like, comment, subscribe, you know, all that stuff that good YouTubers remember to say in their videos. Um, but please go follow me over on Twitch. I am going to try and stream more often, especially with Valiant's bingo coming up. I'm going to try and stream as much of that as possible. But that content actually probably won't make it into, into anything until like episode four. Um, but I'm going to shut up. And I hope you enjoy the rest of your day, morning, evening, whatever. And I'll catch you in the next one.